Hi everyone, how's it going? Today, I want to share with you all an incredible plugin for WordPress called WordPress File Download. It's a highly powerful and useful tool that's also incredibly easy to use. It functions just like a desktop file browser, allowing you to manage a massive number of documents and files with ease. What sets this download manager apart from the rest is its full integration with Elementor Page Builder. It comes with three dedicated widgets called WP File Download File, WP File Download File Category, and WP File Download Search Engine. So, without further delay, let's dive into how this fantastic plugin works. Welcome to WP File Download's main display. It's incredibly user friendly and easy to use. On the left column, you'll find the Categories and Managing bar. Creating a new category is as simple as clicking on the Add Category button or right-clicking to create a new category from scratch. It's important to note that the new category will always be placed in your current location, but you can easily move it later by using the drag and drop feature. If you right-click on an existing category, you'll see a variety of options that you can use to manage it. You can rename it, duplicate it to make a copy, change its color for more advanced organization, or select Edit Category to access even more advanced options. Now, let's focus on the center area of the display, where you'll find the File Upload and Managing section. You can easily drag and drop files from your computer into this window, or click on either of the two buttons to upload files. For demonstration purposes, I'll upload one of my folders to show you some additional features. Once the upload process is complete, all the files within the folder will be displayed like this. You can use the search bar up here and the sorting tab to manage your files more efficiently. However, these are just the basics of WP file download. Let's move on to the Elementor page builder to see how this plugin works within that platform. As I mentioned earlier, WP file download is a download manager that offers full integration with Elementor page builder. There are three dedicated widgets available, WP File Download File, WP File Download Category, and WP File Download Search Engine. Now, I'll insert WP File Download Category into my page content and choose the file category I just uploaded. Let's preview how the files from my category will be displayed on my Elementor page. As you can see, each file has a preview and download button respectively. The preview button allows you to view the file's content, and the download button allows you to download the file to your device. It's actually quite simple and easy to use. However, the file download plugin has even more capabilities. If you go back to the file download plugin page, right-click on the category, and select Edit Category a new window will pop up, allowing you to access more advanced options to customize your file download. For example, the Access Limitation feature allows you to define who is allowed to download or update a file, delete a file, or edit only their own files, among other things. Additionally, it's possible to restrict access to a file or a file category to certain WordPress users only, or to use the theme settings to change the way your files are made available to your users. You can learn more about the file access in this dedicated video link that will pop up on top of your screen now. Let's try changing some themes to see how they'll affect my page's content. I'll choose this theme, head back to my Elementor page, and reload the page to update the content. Now my files are displayed differently. With these settings and options available in the Edit Category section, you can personalize your file's display and your page contents to your liking. The second widget offered by WP File Download is the File widget, which allows you to choose a single file from a category. It also provides the same preview and download features as the category widget, and you can customize the appearance of the files in the Icons Builder section. In here you can upload new icon to your Elementor page, or go to Single File to custom the file configuration. In here you can change many files design settings such as, icon size, file title, file description, file information, or download and preview button. You can adjust and customize these settings to your liking as much as you want. The third widget that we have is called WP File Download Search, and it's mainly designed for searching files in your categories or even in your entire file repository. 
To use this widget, you can select the category in which you want to search, enter your search term in the search bar, and use the time filter to refine your search results. Let me give you an example. Suppose I have uploaded a file named picture before, and I want to find it quickly. I can simply type its name in the search bar and click on search. As you can see, the widget displays multiple files with similar names, so to narrow down my search results, I can select a specific category or filter my search results based on the time of upload or modification. By using this widget, you can save time and quickly find the files you need on your Elementor page. To wrap things up, let's take a look at the pricing for the plugin. In addition to all the plugin features we just covered, WP File Download got all the tools you'll ever need for a download manager, like a file search engine, file listing themes, among many others. WP File Download plugin offers many third parties plugin integration like DD Builder, Gutenberg, and Elementor, which I demonstrated earlier in this video. There are also some cloud connectors like Google Drive, Dropbox, or OneDrive. The plugin is available for $49 which includes all the features I mentioned in this video. But if you want to use the Cloud Connectors add-on for example, like Google Drive, you'll need to upgrade to the $69 option. Thanks for watching this video. If you're watching this video from YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay informed about new plugin features and ask us any questions using the comments. And of course, you'll find all the useful links we've talked about in the description. Have a productive day, bye.